Hi friends, welcome back to my channel. I'm looking a little rough today, but this is what we get. So I'm going to share a little friend mail with you. And then I'm at the end, I'm just going to do a little bit of a project share and show you what a wuss I am and eh, I'll show you what I'm going to do. Anyway, to start this off, I got some friend mail from Amy's Got a Glue Gun. And thank you so much, Amy. I think I got this the day before I went to California and I didn't get a chance to open it or film or anything because I was busy packing and all that stuff. But anyway, I have to show you just the cute duct tape and the stickers and all that fun stuff. Um, she let me know that she was going to be sending me a pocket letter and um, I didn't get any Valentine's pocket day letters done this year just with all of my health issues and everything. There was just no way I was getting to it. So, but I plan to change that. So anyway, I'm going to go ahead and open up this wonderful little envelope of goodness and share with you what I got. Oh my goodness. Okay. Oh my goodness. Lots of stuff here. Okay. So first and foremost, I got some beautiful, beautiful cards. Those are nice. I will use those. Thank you very much. In fact, I'll probably use one of these tomorrow because um, I'm going to take some cookies to the gals at Wound Care tomorrow for, for a thank you. And so I think I'm going to use one of those because those are adorbs. Okay. Oh, here's a little card that looks like a homemade card in a homemade envelope. It says my name on it. You're so sweet. Oh. She made that. Look how cute that is. Happy Valentine's Day. Love, Amy. Oh, I love it. Thank you so much, Amy. You guys are so many goodies here. My goodness. Okay. Oh, say Valentine. I will be yours. Oh, how cute is that? And then some goodies in the way of stickers. I got this little bag of some of these little, I don't know what you call them, little gems. But I have used these for pocket letters before. So I will absolutely use these. Oh, and here's another little bag just full of Valentine's Day goodies. Stickers and it looks like some doilies. Oh, Amy, those are so cute, and I love owls. Oh, I'll have to use those in some spring pocket letters. Thank you. Oh, now this is cute. I have never seen this before. Oh, I will put this with my Valentine's Day stash, because I have quite a stash these days, with a little heart paper clip. Oh, so cute. Those are, I've never seen those before, those stickers. And, oh, this is wonderful. Thank you. Some pieces of scrapbook paper, which we all know I can use. Oh, thank you. And then this other one I want to show you because this is stinking cute. Look at that one. Thank you so much, Amy. And I got a cute little pencil. It's kind of a teal blue. I will certainly use that. And then, oh my goodness, here's another little bag of goodies. Girl, you spoil me for certain. Let me get everything out of here. Oh, that's like some diamond wrap. That's cool. That's cute. I'll put that on my fridge very cute magnet. Oh, look at him. He is cute. This little owl. Love, love it. Oh, oh my gosh. Is this? Yes. Oh my gosh. It's a little notebook, you guys. How stinking cute is that? A little felt heart cut out. Oh, that's cute. A mason jar. And then some other tags that are just so adorable. 
Oh my goodness. I love that one. Oh, thank you, Amy. Thank you so much. And a couple of these little goodie bags. Look at those. Red and Valentine's Day. Oh, I'm going to put this with my stash for sure. And then here, look at this little guy. Look at him, the little love lobster with a little glittery red clothespin. And this will be the pocket letter, I'm sure. In this cute pink little bag. Oh my goodness. Oh, this is so cool. And you did it like the opposite way that normal people, normally people do it. And so that's a great idea. I never thought to do it like that. Oh my gosh. Look at this goodness. Oh, this is beautiful, Amy. I love the colors too. The dark pink, the light pink, and then the teal. They just go perfect together. Very pretty. And then the goodies in the back. Oh man. Oh, Ooh, some washi. So here are the goodies. Look at that washi. I love it. Oh, that's cute. I'm a sucker for you. That's cute. The gold hearts. And these are little chipboard pieces. A lion. Oh, I love this, Amy. And this is a genius idea. Now I'm going to have to steal this idea to put them in sideways like that. That is, I just think that's really unique and different. And that's why I love it. I lo love this. Thank you so much, Amy. Um, girl, you know, I love you to death. I will link Amy's channel down below. Surely you must know who she is. If you don't, you're missing out. Um, she's one very, very, very crafty lady. And I just absolutely love and adore her. So thank you so much, Amy. I love it, love it, love it. Thank you. I appreciate it. Sorry, I'm just now getting to filming this. You know how it is. Okay. Last but not least. I have been wanting to scrapbook for a, a good while now. And I that was kind of, I think, originally why I started getting stickers and, you know, embellishments and things like that with the intention of scrapbooking. But I am intimidated. I have never made a scrapbook before. I have watched many tutorials. And right now, I guess I just don't have enough confidence in myself to actually sit down and, like, make my own layouts on my own. But regardless, I wanted to make a scrapbook of my granddaughter's first year. So I wussed out and I went on Amazon and I found like pre-made scrapbook pages and they are really cute. They're for a little girl. And so I have just spent the last, I don't know, two or three hours like getting pictures printed out and all that stuff. They are really cute, but I think for my very first scrapbook, I need to do this and then I will go from there. Cause actually, I mean, this kind of stuff gives me good ideas of, you know, layouts I can make too. So I'm not going to show you everything, but each month has two pages. So this is like, it says your very first breath or yeah, your first breath took hours away. And then, you know, then there's, so I'm going to do like all newborn in here and let's see, I'll just show you a few. There's the one month layout. I think that's cute. And I have my own embellishments and stickers and things. So, I mean, I've obviously going to add to this a little bit. And then there's the second page of the one month. So this is what I'm going to be working on. Um, this is for 12 months. I don't have an album yet, but I will order one um, or go to Hobby Lobby or something and pick one up. I'm not quite sure what I want to do yet. I was looking for like burlap 12 by 12 albums on Amazon. They are really super expensive. I wanted to get kind of a plain burlap one, 
and then um, embellish it myself. Excuse me, I need to take a drink. But they're like sixty or seventy dollars for one, and no, thank you. So I'm not sure what I'm going to do there. Although I do have that burlap, that thick burlap scrapbook paper, so I could maybe get something really plain and make it burlap. There you go. Anyway, so that's kind of my project now here for, I don't know, maybe the next few months. I want to try and have it done by the time I go back out there in May so I can give it to her mother on her first birthday. So anyway, you guys, that's all I have. Thank you again so much, Amy. I so appreciate it. You know I got nothing but love for you, girl. You are so talented and so sweet, and I just love you. So thank you guys so much for watching, and I'll see you on the next video. Bye.